but <laughs> well here we are again out enjoying the utah they're all tours that's right we're on <laughs> highway 12 we are going far east now we are um on the well they call it scenic highway 12 scenic byway but we're going to escalante uh it's a nice little, I think it's a national park down there, isn't it? A national yeah, monument. said it was a state park. State park? There's a staircase down there. There's a bunch of things that are down there. We're just going to go figure out what they are. But we are at 7,600 feet right here on Highway 12. And we stopped a little bit just to take a picture of everything out here. they got a nice little bathroom here. Some posted signs you can read a little bit. This is one of the last areas in the United States through here. That was unexplored. So this was the last one to be explored up here. As you can see, I don't know, it's probably hard on the GoPro, but uh, man, that's straight down. There's yeah, a they don't whole even have stuff a, like in there. a thing right here either. <laughs> yeah. So a uh, little bit of snow up here still, almost the 1st of May, 2020. We are isolating ourselves. And the waiting coronavirus. for Bryce to open. <laughs> now we stopped at Bryce today. Today's the 29th. No, today's the 30th. And it's still not open. So rumors has it's going to open tomorrow. Rumors has it's going to open the 6th of May. We so don't know. Rumor is it's going to open at some point. That's right. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. We're getting out again today. Partly cloudy skies. I only got down to 40-something last night. And the temperatures are in the 70s during the day. So we can't ask for anything else. So I'm in short sleeves. She's in a long sleeve. But, man, we're just yeah. out here having a good time getting out of the RV. That's right. We're going to go explore. So we're going to go farther down the road. But Yep, go find us a place, have a picnic this afternoon. That's right. We bought our Sammies today again. So That's right. We're, we're, eat, we're cheap RV living because <laughs> <laughs> there's nothing open to buy anything with hardly. <laughs> Otherwise, we'd be happy to uh, contribute. Uh, contribute to the economy. But uh, there's nothing open yet. So please, all you people open things up i uh, understand you don't want a whole bunch of people together but you know if you open up the national parks like bryce or arches you self segregate anyway up there it's not like people are standing on top of each other uh, so I, I just don't understand it i can see when you don't want to pack arenas and and stuff like that people sitting next to each other but come on this president trump open up these national parks at least in the west he's trying to yep all right. All right, we're going on down the road. Ready? Ready. You driving? Nope. Bye. She don't like driving. Take a look at these signboards up here. The second Powell Expedition charting new territory. It's the last blank spot on the map. 1872. The last uncharted territory in the continental United States. Major John Wesley Powell. So we've got that one. And then there's also here fossils. Treasures in these hills. Digging for dinosaurs. Holy crap. 12% gray going down. Have you ever been on a grade that steep? Let me know in the comments below. This may be fun. Maybe not. Well, what do you think of this? It's pretty. Man, we just came over the summit and stopped at another signboard. <laughs> I call them signboards. But uh, this is a cool little drive. This is where 11,000 years ago our Native American Indians live through here. So there's a lot of fossils, arrowheads and stuff throughout here. They say you can find them all the time. It's a nice little wash that runs through here that goes up through the top of the summit. That's where it starts and it goes on the other side. Hopefully you saw where we came from. Hopefully that video came out. So this is very cool. I mean, it's kind of hard to tell on the GoPro, but that's, a, that's way up there. That's pretty steep. But you can see where pieces have fallen out. But we're almost to where we want to go. Good. What was it? 
Escalante. Escalante. Escalante, petrified for state cook. I wasn't expecting that. But we're coming up on Escalante. Petrified State Park. Let's go and get some fees up here, so we'll figure it out and we'll get back with you. Propane, they got a dump up here. So sit tight. There's the camp host right there. So there's the facilities right there. Coke machine. Areas for tents and little campers. Picnic tables. Let's see what size vehicles we can get in here. That black series an HQ 17. Oh, they got barbecue grills. Looks like primitive camping to me. So they're small little class C's, camper vans, truck campers. This way is where it got water and power hookups. There's a pull through. 30 amp service. So if you stay small, you can get in a lot of places. This is a group area where you can park up here. That's pretty cool. Nice trail right there. There's a class A, about a 40 footer. This is a nice little park. Got a little visitor center here. It's closed. It's supposed to log on online. But if, if you had a little rig, you could camp in there. So there's some trails you can hike here. Got a nice little picnic area. It's a nice little park. Got a trail you can walk up, mile and a half loop. 
pretty moderate to serious hike. So you be, better be ready. Story behind the colorful cliffs. Water built this rocky desert landscape during the late Jurassic period. Travel back 150 million years. How did a forest turn to stone? Where you stand, powerful rivers once flowed. Forests thrived along the river corridors as well as ferns. In a variety of human life. Volcanoes erupted, ash fell like snow, and everything got covered up and stayed there for thousands and thousands of years. The future of our forest depends on you. I agree with that 100%. Very nice. Beautiful. There's Kim. She's checking something out. We may, we may do another picnic lunch here today. What you doing, Kim? Coming to get you to see what you're doing. Yeah, well, I'm just over there reading some storyboards. Were you? Did y'all got a little picnic area up there? No, they just have like benches and stuff. It's not huh. really a... Did you find the petrified yeah, it's tree? Right here. It's cool. Right. It's like it's, it's like it's, it's rock, huh? Yeah. Uh huh. So nice handicap right spots. So this would be good for somebody that's well, there is physically there. challenged. Oh yeah. So there it is. This thing right here. A pathway back in time. If you stood here over 150 million years ago, during the late Jurassic, you would see a lush forest in front of you. Trees over 65 feet high. Back in the dinosaur days. Isn't that cool? So they had to break it up in chunks to get it down here. So you wouldn't have to climb. You can climb way up the hill here and see some more. Very cool. Something to learn. 